in this video, we are going to be testing five crazy build-a-boat experiments that will blow your mind. Starting off with what actually happens when you blow up 400,000 gold chests inside of the game. For those of you guys that don't know, if you actually break one of these yellow chests, it actually does drop gold. And yes, the gold does get added to your account, but is it an extremely laggy block? And right here, I have duplicated like tens of thousands of these chests. And well, I'm going to see what happens if I light all of them on fire and how much gold I can actually make from. I'll tell you guys right now, this is not the the best way to make gold inside of the game i will say that right now but we're gonna try it out anyway and see what we can do here in fact let me just turn my volume up so you guys can hear that. never mind my volume isn't even working forget that i wish i could just throw one giant potion at all of this at the same time oh my gosh look at all that gold right there oh my gosh yo imagine this block wasn't so laggy i'd be able to make so so much gold i would never ever need a gold grinder ever again all right let's go to one giant stack here and let's throw a potion at this giant stack. All right, my game is so laggy right now. So let's throw it right. Let's do it right about here. This, this is a pretty solid stack. Oh my goodness. I just hit all of do this one again. Here we go. It takes three potions and let's see what happens. I don't even know if that hit all of them or not. Uh, oh, there it goes. Now it did. Oh my goodness. Look at all this gold right now. Bro, what in the world? This is insane. I'm lagging everywhere right now, but we are gaining gold. We are gaining gold. It's not it's not terrible. I wonder if I can actually harpoon the stacks together to get one giant stack, but I literally can't even place a harpoon without it completely bugging out from how laggy the game is. So if I try to move that, okay? I kind of moved that stack a little bit. All right, I'm trying to move these chests a little bit more together because I want to get one giant explosion. Do not try this at home, what we're about to attempt. I repeat, do not try this at home. I'm still gaining gold in the bottom right-hand corner of my screen, by the way. All right, I'm going to harpoon this. There we go. All right, this is one giant stack. I think this should work. All right, let me now grab my potions. We're going to throw one right there. We're going to throw another one like this. And then the last one, here we go. This is going to be like 10,000 chests right here, easily. All right, let's see what's about to happen. Oh my, oh. Oh my goodness yo oh my gosh i'm lagging so bad but we are making good gold right now don't mind if i do don't mind if i do and the next experiment that we have is uh can you walk to the end uh without building anything like literally just walking to the end well there's only one way to find out and see if this is physically possible now as i'm walking through this treacherous journey if you guys have any build a boat tricks or experiments myths that you want me to test out in my next video go ahead and comment down below and your comment has a very, very likely chance of being featured if it's a decent idea. So first of all here, I got to jump up on this ledge. Okay. All right. There we go. Step one. That, that's good. Now all I have to do is somehow survive. Good thing I do have the 300% health boost uh, from joining the group on Roblox. So uh, I guess I'll help. If I tried doing this on a brand new account, I'd probably absolutely destroy it. So probably the only trouble we're going to come across is uh, not being able to see through the wall. Because if I hit a rock or anything and my legs are gone, then we're going to have a problem. All right, so first stage, I gotta make a leap right here. I'm gonna take some damage. All good, though. We keep on moving. And next stage is right around the corner here. Okay, so uh, this should be interesting. I gotta jump on this ledge. Oh, this one should be easy, right? I don't think that's an obstacle, is it? Yikes. Okay, we made it. All right, so we're three stages in. We haven't even placed a block or built a boat whatsoever. Keep in mind, I'm not even using any candy either. This is strictly just walking. There's no way this is actually gonna be possible, right? There's just no way this is going to work. I mean, I could be completely wrong, but I guess guess we'll find out as i'm walking through these stages at least i get to admire how cool they look that that's one cool thing i guess usually when i'm going through the stages i'm going like 900 miles per hour because i'm using a gold grinder but besides the fact we're now entering the third stage let's see if i can survive this one. Oh, whoa 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 whoa, 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 whoa. okay okay jump no, 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 no. I need to go back. I need to go back. I need to go back. Okay, so there's a little ledge right here. I have to make that jump right there. Actually, hopefully I can even jump on this. I don't even know if I can. Oh, this is not good. This could be it. This genuinely could be it right here. Jump. Ooh, ooh, I made it. Okay. Wow. All right. We're actually somehow still alive. I really was not expecting this at all. All right. Well, let's walk through this stage now and see what happens next. All right. Next stage is right ahead of us. All right. Let's glitch our camera through here. Uh, yeah. Um, yeah. There's... 
There's just no surviving this. Let's be real here. I guess, like, the only way this would physically be possible if, like, you jumped on someone's moving boat. Oh, look at this, guys. I am toast. I am just done for. There is no surviving this. There's nothing I can hang on to at all. Literally nothing. And the next experiment we're gonna try is, uh, launching, like, 900 purple jets at once and also, like, 900 thrusters at once. This is probably going to break my game. I'm try to turn up the volume for this one. All right, this is going to get very chaotic, but, uh, all I have to do is press launch and then i'm gonna press f and okay everything whoa 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 whoa, whoa. what is even going on I... what the... what's happening i don't even know what's happening anymore it does look really really cool though i will say look at those purple jets the thrusters have completely ran out and i've now completely destroyed the server Oh my goodness. What in the world is even happening here? Oh, there ain't no way I'm going to be able to walk through this. There's no possible way. All right, for some reason, I haven't got flung yet, which I'm super surprised. Oh, I got flung. Yeah, I've completely just littered the server. Oh my gosh. What have I done? It's a mess. This is an absolute mess. And the next experiment that I've been asked to do is remove the water and then go to the end. All right. Well, uh, I believe the terrain moving glitch still works. I really don't know if it does or not. But if I grab myself a harpoon like this and then also the uh, flint knock, I'm going to activate the harpoon, pull this out, shoot this. Oh, and I missed. Whatever you do, do not miss the shot. All right. There we go. We got that. So now theoretically, I can use this terrain moving glitch to then remove the water and then walk to the end. It should be easier than what we did before. All right, well, let's go like this. All right, we're gonna harpoon that. Grab this. Go like this. I think I did it. Did I do it? Um, let me, let me try. Let me try jumping here. Um, okay. We're not taking any damage, but the water is still here. So I think I technically did remove it. Maybe? I really have no idea. Let's try it inside the next stage. All right, we're gonna try it inside of the clock tower stage here. Let's harpoon the water like this, like this. Okay, there we go. Yep, we got that to work. All right, so now I can just walk through the stage like, uh, nothing matters. And let's see if I can make it to the end by doing this i should be able to unless a random obstacle spawns on my avatar that would not be good all right let's do the same thing with this stage here all right let's go like this we're going to remove the water there we go don't mind if i do wait this game's too easy oh no oh i almost just died there that would have been really really bad this game's so easy without any water i mean why would you ever need water when you could just remove the water this is great all right let's try it on the next stage here all right this water might be a little bit tricky but we're gonna find out i keep hitting an invisible rock what is this all right there we go we got the water now let's go like this and yeah, this is gonna be a pain. Oh, no. Oh, no, 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 please don't. Not like this. Not like this. All right, let's try doing that. There we go. There we go. Now we got it. Now we got it. Oh, no. Oh, no, that's not good. Oh, I'm dead. Oh, I'm so dead now. No, I'm actually losing damage. It's not good. Not good at all. Oh, yeah. Why does this water have so much water in it? What the heck? Those were definitely some crazy, crazy experiments that we tested in this video, but we need even more crazy experiments. So go ahead and comment down below right now any crazy experiment inside of the comment section down below. Just don't include any Robux inside of it because I have like 800 Robux left. I've spent over 300,000 Robux on this game. So um, yeah, I, re I really don't have any Robux left to spend. So just leave Robux out of it, okay? Please. So comment down down below any myth secret experiment anything you guys want me to test out inside of build about comment down below and you have a really really good chance of being inside of the next video i'll see you guys all later peace out and